All right, are you ready for some girl bossery? What is up you guys? It's Amber, welcome back to my channel. And today, sponsored by New York and Company, I'm gonna show you how to dress like a boss. So without further ado, from my very own office, a very extra girl boss lookbook. Mm -hmm. Isn't it just such a beautiful day? Oh, by the way, um, yes, I am filming this video in my new house. I didn't move in yet. I haven't started renovating yet, but I just thought it'd be fun to film a vid in here before, uh, before construction starts. So let's change and get started. Da, 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 da. Work. Oh my God, get it? Work as in like work office and work as in work, honey. Because honestly, I just figured, you know, girl boss things, owning a home, girl boss things, filming girl boss lookbooks. So anyways, aren't you guys excited to see what I think is appropriate for a workplace? <laughs> Ta-da! Here is our very first girl boss look. Put this down for a second. Okay, so we have this cute little linen top, adorable with the belt, and then these pants are just fabulous. The pants like this are amazing staple items to have in your wardrobe because they basically go with everything. I'll show you how to wear them a million ways, but like look at that, they make the booty look good too, hello. I feel so grown up in this, I'm like a sophisticated lady. Like, look at that walking through the office. Ooh, 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 ooh. Since we are wearing all white, I went ahead and popped a color with some pink pumps. Pumps are very professional as opposed to open toed shoes. I don't really know what kind of like corporate office thing that is, but that tends to be a thing. Like, I'd probably wear this if I was a saucy magazine editor. The devil wears New York and company. P.S. This look and all of my other looks today have been sponsored by my wonderful friends over at New York and Company. They have tons of cute outfits to pick from. Whether you're looking for a Sunday brunch look or your office outfit chic, they have everything that any girl boss could ever need. So huge shout out to New York and Company for sponsoring this video. Thank you. I love you. And uh, if you guys want to shop anything that I'm wearing, you can click the link below to twin. Happy shopping and happy girl bossing. So there you go. Voila. That's our spicy look. And voila, next look, slay. So this next look is actually just a twist on what I was already wearing, except we switched up the accessories and uh, switched up the pants, and you can see it totally changes the whole thing. If you change the accessories, you can kind of get away with wearing the same thing over and over again and no one notices. But anyways, point is, you can see the shirt untucked. Sticks out peplum style, so cute. These are white Bermuda shorts. Basically, these are like the cropped version of those pants. Also fabulous, you know, again, for work. They're nice and long. Definitely won't be showing any booty, which I personally would prefer to show booty, but you know, you gotta keep it professional sometimes. And again, you know, if you throw on the jacket, look at that. We're in a power suit. We're ready to go. Women in power suits, very sexy, by the way. Even sexier, women in power. Hmm. Hmm. Honestly, corporate America, watch out, I'm coming for you. All right, so you can see, as I was saying, just switching something as simple as the top makes this look like a totally different outfit. So you can see these pants coming in clutch yet again. They're just so fun. Ooh, loo, loo, I love that. Um, anyways, here we have a gingham print um, kind of cotton shirt here. Sort of retro vibes, actually, which is super fun. Covers my shoulders for, you know, workplace appropriateness, but also very spicy. Again, shake it up with shoes and accessories. Um, this bag obviously is not really like big enough to be a work bag, but honestly, if you're me and you're just going to like a little YouTube meeting or whatever, <laughs> I know it sounds not real, but that is something that I do. Um, you know, this is actually perfect. By the way, since you know the other part of being a girl boss is living your very best life, watch this. Button up shirts are amazing because of what you can do with them. Yes, they're super versatile. You know, they can be super cute and corporate in the day. And by night, you can literally just pull it out, tie it up, dun da da da, and look at that. Got a whole new vibe. I can go to work like this in the day, change in the bathroom, and uh, go out to a bar right after. Ooh, ooh, ooh. This is so cute. Girl bosses do it all. 
shorts are from New York and Company also, by the way. How cute are those? They're like super stretchy and like a little bit longer than usual Daisy Dukes. So, you know. <gasps> Cinderella. I got the blue top and everything. But point is, again, you can see, look at that. Different outfit, but the same outfit. Honestly, for most of your wardrobe, work clothes, whatever, you really just need like three outfits that you can kind of shake up back and forth. One of my favorite um, ever pieces of shopping advice is if you like it, buy it in every color. Like this is the same cute little puff sleeve shirt as the black shirt, so you can obviously get tons of use out of this one, but this is probably the actually most corporate attire I've put on so far. Hmm, I'm ready for my lunch break. You know, I honestly think this is probably one of the classiest outfits I've ever worn in my life. Girl bosses love a good country club moment. Honestly, I've just been really into the country club aesthetic and kind of wanted to incorporate it into this video, even though it doesn't really go. How cute is this little ribbed shirt? Oh my God, so adorable. Even something as simple as a plain white t-shirt can be made to be fabulous with the right accessories. Like you can see the shirt itself is a fabulous little staple item, so cute, definitely just adds a flair to the typical white tee. Put it with a black skirt, black sunnies, black bag, black pumps, hello, ready. Ready for what? I don't know, but we are ready, aka ready for anything. And that is one of the pillars of girl bossery. Plus look at that, if you stick the peplum up out over a blazer, how adorable is that? Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. That's business, baby. And I'm in the business of making you feel fabulous. <sighs> I love being in the business of making women feel powerful. So just in case you missed it, you are very powerful. Remember that. You wanna know a secret? <gasps> Boss bitches wear color. Can I say bitches in a sponsored video? I don't know. How freaking fun is this? Oh my god, work, work, work. Okay, so um, this is our next little look here. You can see this is basically just like a long t-shirt dress and then um, I made it pop. Dresses like this are great because they're an everyday kind of piece that you can dress up or down depending on the occasion. So, you know, get this dress in green, you could wear it to the Christmas party with some diamonds or you could just also wear this one to brunch like I'm going to tomorrow. You can see nice form fitting, very long too. So this is actually, I think the longest dress that I own, but very actually business office appropriate if you, you know, are into that. Matching a dress to your shoes is very hot girl energy. So we have these, how fun is that? I love that. Just a little bit something fun to make it pop. And with the bag, you know, I also been really into headbands lately. So that's why we got that going on, but very, very spicy. Also sunglasses shaped like butterflies to really go with the butterflies. Again, look at the booty. Work it. I'm about to break my back for this angle, but you get the point. <laughs> Hello, I'm ready to take over the world. Who run the world? Girls. Who run the world? Girls. Girls in yellow dresses. Oh, I love the clip clop of heels. It's like the sound of a confident woman. So this is like my take on a business suit. You guys know I'm not exactly the world's most professional person. I do, in fact, uh, not actually have to go anywhere. This is my job, so I can wear whatever I want. But the idea is, if I was professional, I'd probably dress a little like this. I literally am obsessed with matching sets. We got the shirt matches the shorts, matches the jacket, which is now on the ground because I got hot, but uh, oh my God, look at her, Miss Safari professional chic. Brown shoes, brown bag, just to be spicy. Oh, this looks like I'm in a jazzercise video, hell yeah. A lot of people overlook brown as a really nice, uh, you know, neutral color if you're bored of wearing the same black suit every day. A fun twist on it is brown, so. Obviously for real corporate America, I'm not really sure if you're allowed to show your knees or not. I kind of actually have no idea, but fun fact, I did actually have a corporate internship once where I actually did get in quite a lot of trouble quite a lot of times uh, for what I was wearing. But honestly, that was my own fault. I don't know why I thought it was okay to wear, um, you know, clubbing attire to work. You live and you learn. <laughs> Honey, I'm home. I don't really know what kind of job exactly I have in this outfit, but who cares? Oh, being a girl boss. You can have whatever job you want. There you go. Ready for my meeting, darling. You know what's something we often forget? All the girl bosses who work from home. Like me! 
and honestly most people this last year, but anyways, all right, so you need some cozy stuff to lounge in. Hello, softest outfit on the planet. Like, you know I love wearing bathrobes as outfits. We have these super soft little booty shorts with the nice thick waistband to like keep you soft and cozy. The matching bathrobe, so soft. I literally will wear house slippers outside because I just don't really care what people think of me, so I'll do whatever I want. Which also, by the way, another pillar of girl bossery, doing whatever you want and not caring what people think. Life altering advice. Anything's office attire if you make anything your office. <laughs> How cute are these jeans, by the way? Oh my God, adorable. This isn't really one of the looks, but a bonus look. I have casual Friday every day and many other girl bosses do. These are just like a really nice professional washed jean. Fancy. And last but not least, if your office lets you have casual Fridays. Last but not least is this. A cute little tee with rhinestone lettering. Because the number one girl boss thing to always remember is that truly nothing is impossible. Chase your dreams, go get that job, start your own business, and shoot for the stars. If I've learned one thing in my life, it really is that absolutely nothing is out of reach. If you chase it and want it badly enough and, uh, you know, a good pair of shoes doesn't hurt either. And while a good outfit to get you there is fun, um, it's really what's on the inside and that matters. So don't forget that. And on that note, thank you again to New York and Company for sponsoring this video. Thank you for watching. Go be a girl boss. Kisses till next time. XO. I just spit a little. <laughs> <clears throat> Professional.